Folks, I am so happy to announce we have a returning guest and someone who will be a feature on this channel every Monday, the one and only Casey from Brick by Brick. How are you doing, Casey? I am doing so great, Michael. I am so, so excited to be here today. Thank you so much. Oh, I've, we've been on the channel many times. We've hosted a couple Instagram lives together. You are a regular, but now you're going to come back every Monday, and I appreciate you, and the audience is going to love you. So thank you so much. Thank you. So first thing I want to do is I want to go back to the very beginning because a lot of folks are interested in real estate investing. Uh, but for many of us, certainly if it's going to be an investment purchase, we need to save up for the down payment. In some lending environments, that could be as little as 10%, some 20. The lending environment we, we may be going into might be as high as 25%. I think your story is very interesting is how what you were doing, what I'll call a side hustle. I don't know if you saw it as that. But you were doing something extra to stack little pieces of paper called cash that initially became enough for your down payment. So go back to the very beginning, talk about your interest level, and let's highlight what you were willing to do to get that cash. So my husband and I moved to Memphis from Southern California in 2013, and I knew nobody. We bought a fixer-upper. We're still living here today. It's, this is our 10th year. And we came over with a two-year-old, a three-week-old, a cat. Again, no, didn't know anyone. And I wanted to buy real estate. I was a, a real estate agent in California before we moved here. I had made a probably, I mean, at least 40 offers on potential rental properties and never really pulled the trigger. And when I moved here, I said, okay, Blake, like, there's no more chickening out. We have to do it this time. He's like, well, Casey, we just bought a house. Like, yeah. So uh, yeah. we're kind of we're kind of cash poor. <laughs> yeah. No. So it's our first house, and we bought a yeah. fixer, and we have a baby, and uh, stuff like that. So, and one income, you know, wasn't working. That was a whole thing. If I got to move here, I didn't have to work. And it was like well, you're gonna have to figure out how to make some money for a down payment if you want a rental property. And I'm like, you're joking. <laughs> I mean, 